Ancient Lantean drone weapons, most often known simply as drones, are a supremely advanced hybrid projectile energy weapon employed both in ship-to-ship -ship combat and in surface-based weapons platforms. Equipped with highly sophisticated onboard sensor systems and in-flight maneuverability, drones are able to track and pursue almost any target with little difficulty, and their advanced energy fields allow the weapons to bypass the defence shields of some less advanced starships. 36 inches in length and vaguely squid-shaped, drones project an energy field across their surface that is able to burn through almost all forms of conventional matter without damaging the drone itself. This allows a drone to fully perforate a hostile ship and emerge from the other side, before coming about and making another strike on the target. A drone can usually make two or three such runs before expending their energy supply, and the weapons are programmed to explode violently, either upon depleting their energy supply or when detonated remotely. Drones were typically controlled using a control chair, a form of neural interface system installed on most Lantean ships and installations. Using a control chair, a single operator is able to take direct control of any number of drones, often using swarm tactics to maximise damage when engaging larger fleets. Any drones which have failed to deplete their energy supply after an attack is completed are programmed to automatically return to storage, where they can be recharged and used again. Drones are among the most powerful spacecraft-mounted weapons in existence, and when skillfully aimed, the weapons can target vital systems aboard a large vessel for critical damage. On one occasion, a Lantean gate ship under the control of the Tauri was able to destroy an undamaged Hatak-class mothership using only two drones. Drones are also able to effortlessly bypass the organic hull plating of Wraith Hive ships, and should a drone lose contact with its control chair after launch, the weapons are able to independently select and engage targets, evade weapons fire, and navigate obstacles. Lantean city ships and outposts carry hundreds of thousands of drones at maximum capacity, storing them in colossal drone storage bays. Though Lantean warships such as the Aurora-class battleship lack the internal space to carry so many drones, the several hundred weapons they do carry are more than capable of destroying multiple hostile vessels in a single salvo. It is even possible for a drone to be manually armed and deployed as a timed explosive should regular ordnance be insufficient or presently unavailable. Due to its nature as a precision weapon, intended to target vital subsystems and operate in swarms, a drone is less effective when employed as a ground suppression or assault weapon. However, the ancient Lanteans were able to circumvent this problem with the development of miniaturised anti-personnel drones. These far smaller weapons were used in much the same way as their larger counterparts, but intended to target hostile infantry units and defend ground installations. The effect of these smaller drones on their victims is as violent as one would expect, borrowing through armour and flesh with trivial ease. Unlike their larger counterparts, mini-drones can be provided with a constant stream of power remotely and set to operate in short-range search patterns to protect territory from intruders. Widely used by the Lantean military throughout their war with the Wraith, and still employed by the Tauri over 10,000 years later, the drone is one of the most sophisticated and lethal weapon systems known to man, and remains unmatched by any major galactic power to this date.